Houston. Yeah. Happy 11 months old. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. How many teeth do you have now? Five, six. You have a lot. Six. Six. Four or five for sure, and then two that are just breaking through. Okay, let's tell them about you this month and what you learned and what you did. <laughs> Good job learning how to wave. Oh, now he wants the water again. You ready for another drink? He doesn't know what to do. Oh, oh yeah! Way to shake your booty. Ten and a half months old, looking like a big boy. Uh-oh, how are you going to get out of there? You got to back it up. Houston. Hi! Hi! Houston, hi! Do you like your new room? How come you're playing with the only thing that's not a toy in this whole room? <laughs> you know what you can get them out of here? Houston, how do you like your new car seat? Houston. How do you like your first outing at the new Shields? Well, you love it? Moose. Look Are you so moves. excited? Look at him. <laughs> wow. He's a big one, huh? Is that a big moose? <laughs> cool. Look at Cool. Remember when we saw that picture? Do you like it real? Oh, wow. They have a ball to eat. Go under there. What in the heck? <laughs> Was the jet ski ride fun? Is that so fun? You having fun on the beach on Little Detroit Lake? So this is a new thing banging on the window when dad's mowing the lawn back there, right Husty? You get all excited and start cheering. Good job. Good walking. <laughs> Are you so excited? You just want dad to wave. Oh, there he's waving. He's waving. Look. He's waving at you. <laughs> Oh, that's so awesome. You're so awesome. <laughs> yeah? 
He'll come back. Okay, big boy. Okay, we'll try to do this quick because Mr. Squirmy Wormy Movie is a busy boy, but we're gonna just give a little update of what has changed in all about Houston Joseph as an 11 month old baby. We're in his playroom that's getting all redone. It's probably like 70% of the way there. So I'm gonna let Houston just crawl around and play um, because I don't think, will you sit with me? There's an elephant. So I have some notes on my phone that I'm going to just read off just like every other monthly update. And here we are at 11 out of 12 months. And I can't believe he's almost going to be one. Okay, so he's just playing in front of me. We'll see if he'll be in the video at all. Maybe not. I'm more worried about him trying to grab the camera and pull it down. Okay, he's reaching up right now. So this month, the big thing he's been doing is pointing, waving, and raising his arm in the air. He'll just point at things. He likes to point at lights. He likes to wave to people. When you say goodbye, he'll wave. He, he's waving right now. Say bye-bye. Say bye, Houston. Um, he learned how to do a high five this month, so that was really exciting. I just said high five, and I held my hand up. Do you wanna high five? Good job. So he's Mr. Friendly and likes to, yesterday we were in the driveway and our neighbor was walking to check the mail and he just started waving to the neighbor. Um, he is standing more on his own. Um, he'll, he, he's like so intermittent, like he'll stand up, but then he sits down, he'll let go of things. He did, he has taken a couple of steps, but he's not, definitely not walking, but he has taken like a step or two steps. What crazy. He does a lot of, a lot of dancing. Anytime there's like music or we're clapping, he'll start like bobbing his head and you're a dancer, right? You like to dance? And he has been talking a lot more, not words, but he's just been very verbal and making a lot of noise and expression and just chitter chattering. I think I got a clip of him this month just talking away and like blah, 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 right? Yep. Still in the same size diapers and clothes as he was last month, 18 month clothes, size four diapers. He's getting way heavier this month though, like he's very dense. And our daycare provider said he's been eating like crazy for like lunch and breakfast over there. He's doing really good with his food. He is still having breast milk. He has, that still hasn't changed. Like he has it about five times a day, morning, night, and then three times during the day. He gets two bottles of breast milk at daycare. So we're almost on the final stretch of the one year mark of him having breast milk and then he'll have like cow's milk um, during the day at daycare. And I don't think I ever talked about, but we did do a baby led weaning where we started feeding him solids. Um, we never have given him any like baby jarred, jarred baby food or purees. He started solids at six and a half months and that has, we felt like he's learned a lot through it and eating and he's gotten a lot better at, um, being less messy and his fine motor skills to feed himself. So he's a really good and big eater. He kind of goes through waves of what he likes. For a while he was obsessed with sweet potatoes. Now he's like kind of over them. He likes things with a lot of flavor and he eats pretty much everything. Um, but we try to feed him really healthy, like vegetables, fruit, he'll have, um, like pasta, rice, he eats meat. So this month we noticed he's getting even more attached to me, but that also kind of goes in waves. There was a few nights before bed or a lot of nights before bed if my husband is like holding him and or tries to like, if I try to give Houston to his dad to say good night, he'll start crying because he just wants to go to me. But that could also be because of breastfeeding maybe and he knows that I'm the one that's going to give him his bedtime milk snack. 
He still is a big hair puller, like he rips people's hair. He has a, such a strong grip and like I have my hair down now, but this is a very rare occasion. I pretty much always, what are you trying to do? Are you climbing on your books? I pretty much always have my hair up in a ponytail. He will say mama, mama, but I don't know if it really is means me. It just could be like, words because he started saying dad 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 at first but I don't think he meant means dad he is getting better at riding in his car seat but he still doesn't love it we've gone on a lot of trips up north this summer he's I think Houston's gone four times and it's a three and a half hour ride each way so that has gotten it, him used to being in the car kind of forcing him um from the first trip we took to this last trip he's gotten a lot better he did get a new car seat this month so we transitioned him from his up up baby mesa car seat which is an infant car seat to the Graco forever i don't exactly know the name of it but we got it through target and we got one for each car and he seems to like it and it's working well. It's kind of cool because that one has two cup holders. So I think he likes to put some like toys in there and it's kind of fun because we can set his sippy cup. Over this month, we started introducing and trying to give him more water. So we always try to offer him a sippy cup of water during meals or, you know, especially for outside on a hot sunny day. Yeah. Over this month, Houston went on two trips up north to northern Minnesota. We spent a lot of time outside and on boats. He's been on a lot of boats this summer and he swam in the lake this month and he also went on his first ride on a tube. It was so cute. He went with Daniel and my cousin and then three other little kids. So there was two adults and then four kids under the age of like five and Hi, do you want to come be in the video? Remember when you went on the inner tube? Remember when you rode on the tube? You loved it. Can you see yourself? Look, oh no, don't move it. Can you say hi? Hi, mom. Say hi, mom. Yeah, you love being on the inner tube, but remember your dad let your, oh, don't get mom's earring. Don't get mom's earring. Remember, Dad let your hat fly off, and then it was lost in the lake, and I was like, that's my favorite hat. And then we had to go and find it, and we got it out of the lake, and it was going to sink, but we got it. Ooh. Okay, that is everything that I had written down for this month. He's been such a joy, um, and I can't believe one month, I know I've been saying that like for the last three months that I can't believe he's almost gonna be a year old, but really I'm planning his party and it's becoming more real, and I'm working on a video for when he turns one year old, like a compilation video, and it's getting me very emotional, and I can't believe how fast this year has gone and how much he's grown and learned and it just makes me so emotional thinking about like celebrating all the firsts in the first year like him rolling over and sitting up and sleeping through the night and there's just so many changes and I'm predicting that he might start walking this next month maybe by his first birthday so thanks for watching and I know I'm just going to cherish and enjoy looking back and seeing you see um, this young and all the fun stuff that has happened during his first year of life. Can you say bye, Houston? Say bye-bye. Can you wave? Is that confusing? Do you like your new playroom? Do you like it? Are you going to crawl on me? Okay, say bye-bye. We'll see you in the next one when I'm one year old.